I can see myself as a trophy wife to some super hot rich billionaire and we're gonna go vacation in Singapore every winter but ideally he'd probably be in like tech so we'd probably live in like Atherton and I'd like to have a new set of tits, a new ass, probably two less ribs. Um, I'd like to shave down my jawline a little bit, but it's not necessary. And ooh, LASIK. No more contacts for me. So I'd just look hot and go to like yoga, hot yoga. I don't know what the hot part of hot yoga is, but I'm gonna assume it's looking hot. I guess find like a nice bridge to live under, something like that. Like as long as it's like. I think as long as I get like nice ceilings, like 20 feet, I think I'd be pretty happy. Anything less than that, I think would be a little, a little cramped. Well, if, if we're going, you know, uh, the bridge route, I, you know, at that point, there's not much going on in my life, right? So if I'm living under a bridge, then might as well try to find a family, you know, put together a family or something like that. But if I'm working in basketball, like, you know, that's that shit's too, way too busy. It's hard to like kind of make time for things when you're traveling all over the country and stuff like that. But, you know, got a plan for extremes, so that's kind of where I'm at. Career-wise with college, everything being done, I'd like to enter the medical field, personally, working with people, working with patients. I feel like it's just kind of something fun, atmosphere-wise. As far as like a lifestyle goal would be, I've kind of pictured myself, not necessarily with a giant family, but maybe just like me and my boy kind of traveling around the world. I've always wanted to travel. I'm really adamant about going to Greece. So I'm gonna go to Greece and I'm gonna travel. Anything as far as activity goes, I still just wanna be outside, outdoors, living in like Pacific Northwest area. So I don't know, I feel like in five to 10 years, everything's gonna kind of be set up for me. One, I wanna be a chess grandmaster. Um, I've been really into chess recently. Um, I'm sitting on a solid uh, 470 ELO, um, only need to go another 2500 to be even be close, but it's a couple of years, a lot can change. Um, and if that doesn't work out for whatever reason, then I want to be a surgeon. I, I don't know, I guess it just, it makes me happy. I'd feel fulfillment, and so that's the goal. Probably going to continue with my studies, hopefully get my degree, get in that law enforcement. After that, if that doesn't work out, probably going to go back to Mexico, going back to my roots, you know. And I don't know if I told you this, my cousin is El Chapo. And me and El Chapo, um, we had this really bad relationship so far. I mean, the guy got arrested. El pendejo, no sé qué putas hizo, que lo agarraron. Y pues yo quería el control de toda esa madre, pero vinieron los putos federales y se lo llevaron a la verga. So anyways, I'm trying to take over all that and hopefully be the new kingpin. Rule that shit around with our new cartel called Los Dorilocos. Me and the Dorilocos.